art by Inked Playmats at InkedPlaymats.com. Your place for custom-made playmats. Design your own or shop from other featured designers. Use promo code CLOTSDILL to save 10% on your order. Inked Playmats. Your game, your style. ...to do on their website and come join us for a fun-friendly F&M environment. Kevin from Klotz Productions, and welcome back to another Highlights Magic the Gathering gameplay. For this match, it is me playing my Glissa control deck, and I'm going up against Josh with Mono Green Infect. I took a mulligan down to 6 for this game, and then Josh started on the play with Ninkmoth Nexus, and then I laid down a Woodland Cemetery. He then put a Force in the play and played an Icker Claw Mirror. I then put an Evolving Wilds in a play and passed it back, then Josh attacked with his Mirror. He used a Titanic Growth on it before damage, however in response I went down to 16 to kill it with a Dismember. Then at the end of the turn, I went ahead and sacrificed my Evolving Wilds to find myself a Swamp. On my next turn, I put a Buried Ruin in a play, then played a Liliana of the Veil and forced both players to discard cards. Josh got rid of a Mental Misstep, and I threw away a Ratchet Bomb. Josh animated his Nexus and attacked with it, giving me my first Poison Counter, then I just laid down another Evolving Wilds and passed it back. He hit me with his Nexus again, and then at the end of his turn, I found myself a Force with my Evolving Wilds. I then played a Garrick Relentless and made myself a Wolf Token. Josh laid down another Ink Moth Nexus and played a Wild Defiance. I then attacked with my Wolf, taking him down to 18. Then post-combat, I played a Trading Post and made myself another Wolf Token. Josh animated his Nexus and attacked with it again. However, before damage, he went down to 16 to use a Mutagenic Growth on it. It became a 6-6 because of the Wild Defiance, and then he went down to 14 to play an Apostle's Blessing, pumping in again. This was enough to take me up to 11 Poison Counters, giving Josh the win and taking us to Game 2. So that's it for this gameplay. I hope you all enjoyed it. You can find the full version and the annotations at the end, along with links to my vlog and my Let's Play Duels of the Planeswalkers 2013. If you like this or any other video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and possibly add it to your favorites, then subscribe to be notified when more videos are online.